And today I'm going to be showing you how to create your first iPhone app in Xcode. So, let's get started. Go to Xcode, let, wait for it to load, go to File, New Project, and you'll see under our templates here, there's many templates you can choose from, but we're going to do views, view based application, which is pretty much a general template, um, a good starting point. So, we can click choose and save as to your desktop or wherever you want. Um, I, um, I, iPhone app. Okay, or whatever you want to say. Save that. And um, where we're going to be working in is the classes. And um, I'll make this a little bit bigger. And under iPhone app view controller dot H and the uh, I M. Now I'll try to explain this as best as I can. Dot H, think of it this way, as a dictionary. Dot H is the word, and dot M is where you're defining the word, like, uh, telling it what to do. And um, that's pretty much where we're going to be working in. So, first, we're going to enter our first line of code, right in between these brackets. So, just um, click enter and go right there, and do an IV outlet, which is um, interface builder outlet. And um, we want it to say something, so that will be written on a UI label. And that will be called label. And um, yeah, that's our first line of code. Remember to put a semicolon after you're done. And um, now we'll do one last line of code here with um, the IB and IB action. Um, dash space IB action close cro close parentheses hello ID sender and yeah that's all we have to enter in in here so now we'll go to the dot M and actually define what what we wanted to say so um, you can pretty much go in here and just copy that Oops. Copy it and just paste it right in under the at implementation, which is we're going to be implementing here. Um, curly bracket instead of the semicolon. Under here, we're going to do um, the um, label dot text. The text that is going to show up on the label space equals um, I don't know space actually at and in between these um, quotation marks, you can say anything you want, but in this case, we're going to do hello world. Um, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much what you want to do. And so these are the only two lines of code we need. Uh, remember to put a, a little um, semicolon there. Press enter and close it. Close the curly brackets. And we're done with the coding. Now I'll show you how to. Um, build it in interface build, build the interface so save both these um, go into resources and go into iPhone app view controller dot XID and this is the and the interface builder will pop up okay so we got our view here and I'm just gonna show you how to put a background in and change the color first okay so we drag a view in. Um, you can go to the view attributes and background default color white. You can go click other and make your own color. So just set it to blue or whatever you want. And um, now I'll show you um, what else you need. We're gonna use a round rect button, which we're gonna press. So you can say press me just double click it and it should come up like that and under it is the label remember when we did UI label well yes this is where the text is going to show up so just delete the text out of there and drag it to wherever you want maybe, maybe make it a little bigger uh, smaller whatever you want and that's all we need to do if you want I'll just show you this real quick you can put um, real simple just drag in a navigation bar for your title, save it as app or whatever. Or yeah. Okay.
Okay, so now we have to actually just quickly do linking what we just did. So go to Files Owner, go to um, in Inspector, Files Owner, go to iPhone App Contribute Connections, drag the label to the label, and drag that the hello to press me. Touch up inside. Save that, quit, and build and run. We'll see if we have any problems. Nope, no problems. Let it load up. Press me, and hello world shows up. And um, congratulations, you just made your first iPhone up. Thank you for watching, goodbye.